Today, we're going to go through the basics of what a relay is and how to install it in the Garmin OnDeck system. For this process, you will need to have the OnDeck system installed on the boat, along with any relays you are wanting to install. The OnDeck system comes with one relay in the box, and additional relays can be purchased through www.garmin.com. To perform the installation, some basic understanding of what a relay is and how it works will be beneficial. A relay in its most basic form is a switch that can be operated with an electrical signal. In Garmin relays, there are four main wires with two different functions. There are two control wires and two load wires. The control wires carry the signal to the relay to tell it to close the switch while also powering the load wires. This will then give power to the end device. In the case of the on-deck system, that signal being sent down the control wires is done through digital switching on a compatible Garmin chart plotter. For example, when you want to turn on a light in the cabin of your boat, that signal is sent from the chart plotter to the GTB10 black box. The GTB10 black box then sends the command down the control wires to the remote relay. The switch inside the relay is then triggered completing the circuit for the lights, which then turn on. Now we will walk through the basics of installing a relay in a Garmin OnDeck system. One relay is included in the box, and the OnDeck system can control up to five accessory relays. Those can be purchased online at www.garmin.com. The maximum current that can be carried by a Garmin relay is dependent on the battery system and relay selected. Specifications can be found on our website. Each relay will wire into the 19-pin in-out cable. The relay wire colors on the 19-pin cable are white, white-orange, gray, pink, and brown. Taking one of the colored relay wires, connect it to the white negative control wire on the relay. Connect the black positive control wire on the relay to a 1 amp fuse, located on the positive side of the same power source as the GTB10 black box. Connect the positive wire from the power cable of the controlled device to the blue negative load wire on the relay. Lastly. Connect the yellow positive wire on the relay to the positive terminal of the device's power source. This wire should be the same gauge or a lower gauge number wire as the wire connecting the relay to the device. Finally, connect the negative wire from the controlled device to the negative side of the power source. The load wires are now in line from the power source and the device is being connected. Then, when the control wires are triggered using the system, power will pass through the relay, which then allows the device to operate. To add more relays, repeat the same process using the other four colored wires in the in-out cable. And that's it. For more help, please visit marinesupport.garmin.com. Thanks for watching.